Executive Secretary Lucas Bersamin has decided to dismiss all charges and exonerate all four DA and SRA officials from irregularity and wrongdoing on the sugar importation order number four mess back in August after an exhaustive five-month probe. The full story from PTV's Mark Fitalco. The Agriculture Department respects the decision of the Office of the President to absolve four former DA and Sugar Regulatory Administration officials who were involved in the controversial Sugar Order No. 4. The uh, Executive Secretary has already approved no, yung decision na yan. Uh, we have to respect po ano man ang decision na yon dahil na-investiga naman po yan. Nag-present na yung mga uh, ibang sides na kailang panic at yan po nagpag na in a resolution signed on December 29, 2022, the OP dismissed the charges of grave misconduct, gross dishonesty, and conduct prejudicial to the best interest of the service against former Agriculture Undersecretary Leocadio Sebastian, former SRA Administrator Hermony Hildo Serafica, and former SRA Board Members Aurelio Valderrama and Roland Beltran. Malacanang instead admonished the respondents to be more prudent and circumspect in the performance of their duties. In his statement, Sebastian said he's delighted over the decision of the Office of the President, adding that this will enable them to move forward from a traumatic and challenging experience. On the question whether Sebastian would return to DA since he's in a plantilla position, Esto Perez said, Yan po ang pinag-usapan namin ano, doon sa Department of Agriculture kung ano po ang position o kung anong sitwasyon kung sakaling babalik po. Na which is, uh, sabi nga ni, ni Yusek Leo, na babalik siya. To recall the former agriculture officials authorized importation of 300,000 metric tons of refined sugar in August 2022. Meanwhile, several senators favored the decision of the president, saying the sugar order was done in good faith. According to Senate Minority Leader Coco Pimentel, it only shows that the OP doesn't mind being on the same side as the Senate minority. He is also delighted that the OP is being objective in the said case. However, Senate Blue Ribbon Committee Chairperson Francis Tolentino said the clearance given by the OP for legal affairs does not affect the 97-page Senate Blue Ribbon Committee report which was adopted unanimously by the upper chamber. Meanwhile, Senator J.V. Ejercito said, Ang nahihirapan talaga dito yung, ano, ang kawawa dito yung mga farmers, local farmers, no? not un unless we are able to stop smuggling. No? Uh, tapos ngayon naman, na wala nga yung smuggling, left and right naman issuance ng uh, importation permit. Mark Fetalco for The Nation.